Welcome back to another video of Super Mario Kart Together. I see that part one is actually doing pretty well on the channel. So we're going to continue on with this game. Um, if I can remember how this works. So pressing tab, we are going to grab this. And we're going to put it right here. Oh. Like so. And then we're gonna grab this one. Whoopsie. Put it like this. You can't walk through there, right? No. Uh, the reason why we're doing this is because we have a bottleneck um, of our NPCs getting stuck within each other. Can't walk through there. Can't walk through here. Um, we'll grab this one as well and put it like this. Okay, so I guess this will be a less of a bottleneck now. Perfect. So now our employees can actually walk here and refill the stuff. I think that's good. Uh, let's open up shop. All right. Uh, we want one cashier and one restocker. And let's open the market. Uh, we are still on our way to the stuff that is actually going to make us the most money, which is all the way down here. We want to get to this recycling. Now, it's not going to be that much money that we're going to get from this, but it is going to help over time to get those stuff in. Uh, let's just see over here. Um, I want one. Like, I want green, right? We want green. How much money do we have? 1,200. So, as long as we have green, we know that we have stock. Yo, ketchup is so expensive. I'm pretty sure we get a lot in a bottle as well. So green, green. No green. No green. That's $500 right there. No green. How much are we on now? 1100 so let's buy all of this. It's going to be a lot of boxes, bro. Holy. That's a lot of boxes. Yeah, we, we want to upgrade the cashiers as much as possible. And also, guys, just keep in mind, as long as this video is or series as well, we'll continue on with the series. Uh, so if you do want to see more of this game being played, especially on a solo aspect, I would say, make sure that you, you know, leave a like, watch the whole video, leave a comment as well as it helps the algorithm, give me some advice and tips, what you think is the better way to do things, because I'm still brand new to the game. And I mean, I, I have experience with other games like TCG Card Simulator and also uh, Supermarket Simulator. So it's not like I am like that new, you know. But it's definitely a learning curve since this game is different than the others. Okay, now let's have a look again. Let's see if anything is very low. We're sitting on $500 again. 
hygiene looking fine there 188 of those toilet paper i don't know it seems pretty low Okay, 700. We'll have to wait a bit. Yeah, everything else looks fine, I would say. This is abuse. Yeah, well, don't just stand there. Do your job. Biatch. Okay, how's our queues looking? Looking still fine? Did I honestly wish there was like... How do I say this? No collusion in the game. I feel like collusion is such a big issue. What are you doing, bro? But I feel like this is the better way to do it. And we can later... No, we can't even utilize all the way down there. Because... If I, if I make this line straight all the way down, this is going to be a super bottleneck for everyone, including my... My worker. Looks like our queue is actually becoming full, I would say. Uh, let's buy this. So we need, I would say we need speed next for our cashiers. It's either that or we need another cashier. No, nah, definitely don't need another cashier. Dude, we're making a killing at the moment. Okay, we can go through it again. What is not green? We only have three bread on the shelf, dude. the milk. The dog food is running really low. to increase the movement speed of our workers. I honestly don't know, like... It's a learning curve, right? I need to learn how this game works to make it better.
I think this cashier is faster than I would be. Already. And you can make it even faster. Dude, we're making so much money, it's crazy. Like, how much stock did I buy? We're back to a thousand dollars again. What? $2,000 to buy this? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me, right? Shelves are still looking full, though. I should check if there's like a mod we can use in the game. That will do like automatic pricing. It's going to be five. This can be five also. It's going to be four. This can be almost four. This can be seven at least. Nine point two. This can be four. Can be almost four. That should be fine. Can be five. Uh, two for sure. Six. Dude, this can be like eighteen dollars, bro. We're really low on bread.
we have two skill points. Here's the bread. Got some shampoo there. And some chunas. Dude, this cashier is making so much money. I wonder if you can actually upgrade the cashier again. Oh, we only have one point, by the way. The last client. All right. So we can end for the day, I would say. Day 13 done. Balance minus 800, yeah, doesn't matter. Our income is 3,800 pretty much. Money lost because of robbers is zero. Rent cost 15. Electricity is 10. Franchise experience plus 1,500. That's crazy, bro. Products not found was two. There was two products not found. So you're removing the cashier and put him as a restocker. So both of them can work, right? So both of them restock right now. Uh, let's have a look here. So we still want to make our way all the way down to this area. So... What is this though? Air conditioning, attract more customers. Dude, as much as I would like to do that, I don't think we have the capacity at the moment to attract more. I think our dudes really struggle right now. Employees move 20% faster. Maybe we should just spend the point on that. Let's, let's do it. Because... This will help them rack, right? It also might mean they'll get stuck less. I think. I mean, I'm not too sure. I found it useless before, but now I think it's really good. Um, cashier speed. Icon looks like that, okay. That is really deep down though. And there's also one here. Yeah, we still want to get this. Recycle boxes award four times as much. Oh, dude, we're going the wrong way. Employees will recycle boxes. Oh no. We should be going this way. Not there. Our employee's not going to do anything when I take this. Four times more? No, no, this, this one needs to be first. Then they will recycle boxes. Okay, so the next one is this one right here. Cookie jar. Um, but for now, we could just open shop. So, like this. shop is now open. Just make sure we have green everywhere.
Oh. We're out of the green one. That is one of the products that, was, that wasn't found. I think. <laughs> if that makes sense, though. So I bought like seven times. Uh, how did I miss that, though? Huh. That is a tricky question, my buddy. How many times are we going to buy ketchup? I was still busy pricing stuff. It in my hands, Mabri. Toilet pepper. So you can't get anyone, you can't pay anyone to do stock taking in this game. So pretty much this screen is where you will spend the most of your time. At least that's what it looks like. Okay, I was still busy pricing stuff though. Uh, this can be easily eight. One point eight being six, three point six. This can be almost no, it's fifteen. Three dollars. Okay, um... here that is a six right but it's a five six we had no markup on that one
So as you can see now, my controller, my, my scroll button works. Got a new mouse. I think I went through these already. We're chilling on two thousand dollars again, dude. buy because the pink one running very low on it <laughs> you buy catch up every day bro I think every time you purchase it's catch up it's crazy either people love the catch up or it's underpriced. It's either one of the two. I'm not sure. We have another uh, point to spend. See, we need to get this one, then this one, and go down this tree over here. Uh, toilet paper, bro. Like, why are you not racking it? Why is our guy not racking it? Just spend one and a half K again on just buying stuff. Should I go do the toilet paper quickly? It's because we can only have four, dude. We need to get, have two racks then. I'm scared to attract more clients, but it is, in my opinion, the best way to make the most out of the situation that we're in right now. I mean, how many more clients are we talking about here? If it's like one or two, then it's, it's worth it. But if it's like 10, I don't think my cashier is not going to handle it. We might need to get more cashiers then. Or faster speed on them. I'm not, I'm not too sure.
And also our restocker, I feel like, is falling behind sometimes. I mean, look at that toilet paper situation. Okay. What is not green? Huh? like the tuna we only have five tuna right now that's in on on the shelves and that can, I, I can see that becoming a problem dude Goodness, just put it down, my buddy. Looks like we need more shelves. <laughs> Bro, this is nice. It took a while, but we finally managed to do it. Pretty cool music. It's kind of crazy, dude. There's like so many brooms in this game. But you can't even hire a cleaner. <laughs> I wonder if the security guard actually becomes the cleaner. I doubt it, though. It looks like we're handling this amount of employees f or customers fine. Like, I I'm curious whether we should get more. It's like, what else do we take here? I mean, we'll never take this, by the way. There's no need for it at all. So it's still two away, but it might be the best thing to do. Attract more clients. So yeah, this was not the wrong way. Like, if I went down there, that would have been incorrect. Like, unless you want to make your cashier um, handle products faster, but... I honestly think it's a waste, because you have to wait for them to put it down on, on the shelf. Okay, we'll end the day here. This is day 14 done. So, no rubber still. That's great. Income is almost $5,000 a day, bro. That's absolutely insane. 
And we, we almost got 1900 experience now, which is more than we had yesterday. Everything's looking good. I think we might want to get another employee. To do restocking, right? I mean, again, toilet paper is running pretty low. Why are you putting that instead of toilet paper, bro? Unless we're out of toilet paper. Every day we buy ketchup. I'm deliberately looking for the toilet paper, by the way. So far, not seeing it. There it is. Yeah, we had no toilet paper. Maybe buy two of it then. Okay, so uh, let's open. That's toilet paper maxed out now. And we have another box of it. There's the other one. Sexy, bro. My job's done here. <laughs> but wait, let's have a look. Because there might be more. And there is. Play that weird music for me. The wannabe chopsticks music. Yeah, there must be like st stock taking mods or something that we could be using. Like, we have so cool mods on uh, Supermarket Simulator, it's not even a joke, bro.
And another one. How are things looking here, my buddy? Hey, girl. What's your number? No. No, the other one is better. I'm sure of it. Doesn't even matter if your place is dirty. I mean, I'm not seeing like a a cleanliness meter or something like that. Are you working, son? Why does it look like you're not, eh? You see, the client's is putting it down slow. And he's doing it pretty fast, dude. Compared to how fast they're putting it down. Not even to mention, he's making 10% extra for us. <laughs> so, like, I, I should not be the cashier at all. Not on this game, son. We took that reward real quick. How is things looking, my buddy? Five. Everything is looking okay still. Well, majority is. The stuff we're buying is not, not urgent at all. Sorry about the noises, dude. Like, the wind is blowing extremely hard here. It's not a tornado. It's just, I think, a storm is coming. Did I just see correctly we have two? We have two skill points to spend. Is 
Dude. Sounds like Christmas in my ears, dude. I can just imagine, like, once you have, like, three cashiers and the shop is, like, almost to the max, like, how that's gonna sound like. Let me sweep that can, bro. Are you winning, son? So if we have two skill points, it has to be these two. But like, do we have enough money to get all of this done? Cookie jar, maxi cone, chocolate spread, chocolate powder, chips and sweet. Dude. Dude. I honestly don't think we have the manpower for all of this. This is too many products. We, we might need more help. And like the closest help is like really far away. Up there, up there. Unless the game is like somewhat forcing you to take small stuff just to get the employees as well. So this three away as an employee. And it's way less products. You see right here we can get more movement speed and another cash uh, cashier if you want. This, I don't know man. It was probably down here first, then. Looks like the dogs want to go out. So let me just buy... ...and do this quickly. I'll just pause once the day is done. Days in this game is actually way longer than any other simulation game. Bro, uh, we definitely need some. The tuna's running pretty low, girl. Gotta go faster. Good news. Everything has greens. Well, most of it.
Dude, we're making so much money. So what happens if you have a storage guy and the storage is done, carry it in? Will the guy just stand there? I mean, we could min max manage that guy, right? We could be like, okay, it's storage time. Okay, rack time, you know? And all, like every now and then, just speak out. Like, is is there boxes? So yeah, we need to get another employee fast. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, six skill points away. So we can't go that direction. This is one, two, three away, and this is one, two, th three, four away. So this is the safest route to go then, for now. So we take these two and then employee. Is that all? Nothing else to clean? Okay, guys, give me a second. I'm gonna let the dogs out and stuff. We'll be right back. Okay, well, that's done. Are you kidding me? Bro, they just used all our stock. Now it looks so empty again. Okay, so... One, two, three, four. One, two, three. So we have to go this way first. For this employee. Right. We do need more help, right? It's just more helpful, so yes, I would say. Like, we're gonna go this way eventually anyway. But it's just one, two, three, four, five, six away. That's a bit too much. A lot of move faster. Wow. Wow. Dude, let let's let's just go this way. We're gonna make more money if we go this way, for sure. So let's take this one. So we got our new products now. Oh, is this one sweets? So we're gonna buy one of each. And if we're lucky, we can actually take the other License also. Zero. Oh, thank you for this. Cookie jar. Chocolate spread. Let's get them, give them work. Uh, so this one, how much is that? Seven dollars. This one is not four, just underneath. And this one.
It's not six. This one. There we go. I think we need another shelf. This might actually cause a bottleneck. Yeah, it for sure will, dude. 100%. I think this is the best we could do. Got some chips, baby. Two dollars, easy. And then we have a maxi cone. Wrong container for the product. Oh snap, we need a... Uh... Do you think it's a fridge? It has to be a freezer. It should say here. Yeah, it's a freezer. It's our first product in a freezer. Now, I'm not going to buy this one. We'll buy the bigger one. Boxes in the way. Yeah, we'll get two of them. What's this? 7.8 Okay, then we have another one Which is this one right here Dude, it's so many products Oh my goodness I don't think we have the money $800? We don't We don't, we don't have the money um, we'll have to end the day here and save up a day and hopefully we don't need help.
Made almost 5k. Got an extra product license now, so hopefully this is going to be enough. Okay, let's do uh, our stock taking. Yeah, we 100% can't get another product license for now. I have a look. Why am I not hearing cha-ching cha-ching stuff yet, huh? These people are only walking in now. Goodness. We have to wait at least for a thousand dollars. Dude, we're about to hit another level, by the way. The thing is like so full. And then we're gonna hit level 17. So you level up pretty fast in this game as well. I don't think this game is as good as a uh, supermarket simulator, but it's it's good, right? It's a pretty good game. Like for a game that's free to play, I think this game is phenomenal, almost uncomparable. Um, the talent tree thing is so cool. The pricing, the, the way you price stuff in this game and the collusion that you can have, I feel like those are the two biggest concerns for this game, in my opinion. Because it's not like they're going to try and walk around each other. No, they're going to try and walk through each other and just get stuck. We just leveled up. Yeah, this, this line is so much more money, though. And you know what? We're not even that full. Yet. looks like a man, dude. Her name is most probably Amanda. <laughs> what a stupid joke, I'm sorry. My bad. Taking care of all these products, it's gonna be awesome.
We're back already at $400 stuff, dude. We have 450 toothbrush toothpaste. Come on, man. Are you serious? 100 toothpaste? That that's a bit too much, man. fine for now that food is so expensive though like both of them it's quite quite a lot okay we'll just buy this we have three dollars, dude. That's how much I have in real life. You know what I'm saying? I'm a broke beach. I used to be a rich beach. But then YouTube is like, nah, dude. We'll promote other channels. We don't care about you anymore. There's better people out there. And I'm just sitting here all by myself, broke. Thank you, YouTube. You're making my dreams memes. If that's a thing. <laughs> So yeah, just bottom line guys, just keep on showing love and support towards the series and I will keep playing this game. We're gonna get really far, you know what I'm saying? We will make this game great again. <laughs> Stock is looking good, but it can always look better. Let's have a look here again. Actually, that might be... Yeah, we don't have to get that. We honestly have to get both of these. Get some more toothpaste. It's so expensive as well. $200 for a hundred. Why don't I hear peep, 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 huh? Thank you. You're making me confusing or confused. Making me confused. What is English? Shell space again. Okay, we're officially full. We 
can't mix products in. Well, then show me where this is, dude. Yeah, we can't take the more clients one. I, I'm just honestly, I'm I'm, I'm scared about that. Because if you can't handle all clients, then it's pretty much just GG. They're gonna start stealing stuff because the queue is too full. It's so dark, my buddy. Oh yeah, you can buy lights through this app. Dude, it's a hundred and fifty dollars. I don't even know what it is. It's an aircon. Why would we put this? Who's gonna benefit from a TV? Here we go. These lights are just gonna make us take more money or, or lose more money for no reason. You see, now if they walk through this and they steal, we'll know. Or there's no one in queue, and then all of a sudden there's four. Like, are you kidding me? One at a time, take a number. So what else we can do is we could move the checkout a little bit deeper in. And then we can use this well as well for more products. Definitely have a bottleneck here at the entrance.
Okay, another day is done. And dusted. Nice, dude. We'll end the day here. Total customers, 122. Times robbed, one. 2,000 experience. Dude, we have three levels. But we do just don't have the money right now. One, two, three. We just don't have the money right now to get more product licenses, so... We'll just open shop for the day. Actually, I'm gonna re uh, restock everything. Um, then I want to change this from restocker. We get one storage. I want to see what happens. You drop the box, right? Yeah. So what happens after you did all these boxes then? So we definitely need more movement speed. Especially if we're gonna get, uh, gonna get all our restockers to recycle all the boxes. Dude, it's gonna take forever. Let me just help. Are you winning, son? So I can restock three boxes before you restocks one. Okay, so he's doing the last one now. I want to see what happens. Will he just stand there, or is he gonna... Restock the shelves. So he's just gonna stand here. So that is a little problematic, actually. But we can... We can... Like, if we have two stock takers, we could shuffle them like that. But I'm also curious, like, if they have a box laying around, what will happen? Will it go and pick up the box? So I think if I put them in storage, they pick up the box from the floor. Yeah. 
Okay, now if I put him on storage... He's gonna use the box. Okay. So it works as expected, I would say. We can't afford any of these yet, so... Let's open up for the day. Where's our worker? There he is. I thought I saw him walk outside, but clearly that's not the case. Dude, this place is just going to be full of products later down the line. How deep in the game must you go in order to upgrade your storage, dude? So many products we have in here. Absolutely ridiculous. Shop space is only 250. It's so cheap though. Not bad at all. And we're using like literally every inch we can, you know. If you're not big, you have to do that. Every little inch has to be used. You know what I'm saying? If that makes sense. Does that make sense? <laughs> hey, sexy ladies. You guys want to make a man's dream come true? It'll be fun for you too, I promise. Not as fun, but... It's like he has... They always give, like, perfect change for the employees. But later on the line, we also have to get security guards, and... I think... That is the best thing we can do, is just get, like, infinite employees. Every employee that you can get, you should get. Maybe that is the way to go first. Dude, there's two there. There's two here as well. And then the recycle is here. And there's another one here. I mean, this is by far the best line we have to go. We're gonna get employee move faster as well. Um, move faster. We're not going to sell fruit anytime soon. Oh, the queue is a bit too much. Yeah, I think we're going to get people stealing soon. Uh, let's just have a look at some stock first.
Yeah, we're gonna have thieves for sure. Thief detector should go off, right? If someone is stealing. I don't know when it goes off. fast the thing might also be uh, pretty good for security guards Yeah, this queue is way too big. We need another cashier. So I feel like at the moment it's either you hire another cashier or you hire a security guard. I think the security guard is the better option. Dude, is that an empty toilet paper? my broom. Oh, this place is way too busy. I mean, it means it means we're gonna make a killing though, that's for sure. No, I don't have a stick on my hand. That's how it looks like when people steal. There's an icon above their head. And also we heard the sirens, so...
Oof, dude. Five more. Like, we need help right now. Like, it's... We can't go all the way there. There's three. We need to do this. We have three. This is the three. I mean, once we have enough help, we'll be able to... Pretty much do whatever we want then. But get the help first. Running really low on that coffee. That's dog food. Faster. One box too many at the moment. So yeah, we got our first thief. Uh, well, it wasn't our first one, but... The first one we did hit with the broom. So that's pretty cool. No fear, Grandpa is here. Not keeping the place very clean, let's be honest. So the timer is almost done. And clients will stop coming in. Stock taker, I think, just took this one. Yeah, there we go. Margarine's going up now. Dim, 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 dim. 
I think it's quiet now because all the customers were served. Put you on restock duty. Sitting on three and a half thousand dollars, bro. So we definitely have enough now to get the next license or the next products. Honestly, can't believe this is the only storage uh, shelf we have. Oopsie. Okay. It's in the day. Products not found was one. I think it. I think it was the toilet paper. Dude, nineteen hundred XP. We're making bank, yo. All right, let us do one more day. I would say. Do we have four skill points? And I feel like the fourth one has to be an employee. So one, two, three. One, two, three, four. Through this one, we can dump a lot into employees. That one, not so much. But if we go one, two, three, four, then we can't get an employee. Also, you can look at the products there. There's two, four, six, seven. Seven, eight, eight, five. Bro, it's so many products if we go straight down here. Um, we can also do this one to get even faster checkout. It's also a lot of products, but this one is not that much. No, it's still a lot. Yeah. Okay, uh, we need to make up our mind here. Let's go to this one first. Uh, more toilet paper? Goodness. So, this is hygiene. This hygiene one, so this is hygiene two. We're gonna stack it so we can throw away the box and get some minis. Extra soft shampoo. What does it even mean? I mean, I do get your hair goes extra soft, but like, it's kind of weird, isn't it? Okay. 
Okay, so I feel like that is done. Now to just uh, fix the price. Five dollars. Just under eight. Uh, three point two. Eight point, no, it's nine point two. Okay, so that is that product done. So let's get the next one. And then we get the employee. So hygiene three. Bro, it's so much toilet paper. So for that to work, we need to... I think we need to use the metal space. Okay, so now we have three employees. And I feel like that's gonna help quite a bit now. We're gonna put one on security guard while we do stock taking. And once we're done stock taking, we can say, you do the boxes while I, I'll be security, right? that one done okay let's get out our pew pew gun and change the prices dude This is ten twenty. Goodness. So this is what? Almost eight, just under eight. It's two dollars forty. This is 520. Uh, five dollar. I think that's all the products, right? Yeah. So one becomes cashier and the other ones become security. Not so fast. Mm -hmm. 
not so fast. Uh, 20... Thousand four hundred. Two thousand one hundred. So what I can do is just remove some. And instead of security, you will go storage now. And then I'll be security. And we could like stand here and just check the boxes. Once this job is done. This job is done, we'll buy more stuff. I wish there was a way to list by green, the green number. You see right here, we don't have any customization. It's just an employee, where if we went down here, we would make the cashier faster, the racking faster. But it's okay, man. Gotta start somewhere. So many boxes outside still. We do should have more than enough room inside. Um Could be problematic that it's taking so long. People might wonder where this toilet paper goes. We need stuff that's in the freezer as well. We have a double stand freezer, but we, we're not using it at all. Oh, you see the toilet paper is low. Definitely have to increase their movement speed. Or just get more employees. That can also just work, right? Eh?
Here you go, buddy. You had no work to do? Well, you got a lot to do now. Who put my broom there? Someone planning to steal something. Bro, our cashier is actually holding up, which is pretty good. While I have the broom in my hand, let's be honest here. Might as well do some cleaning. Be stuck on something, dude. When you're about to get stuck, just uh, be awesome instead. You know what I'm saying? See, so yeah, thieving or whatever is pretty much a rare event at the moment. I think it would still be better to have another employee do shelf stuff. Instead of, you know, doing storage. Wait for him to store it and then we're gonna tell him Go restock, buddy. I think it's just the way to go right now. We're close enough to hear if there's someone stealing. But yeah, I think an extra employee was was needed for sure. Goodness, bro. Are you winning, son? I think she's winning. I think double restocker is better than having someone stand security. It happens so rare, it's my job to actually do it then.
Looking good. Looking good. Spaghetti is running a little a bit lower. I think we want like five employees as soon as we can. I honestly do think that's what this game is about. Especially if you like play solo like we are. It's just going to become exponentially harder. Harder to stock take, harder to pretty much just do anything. We're not going to have time to do anything. <laughs> so more employees is the way to go. That's what I think. More productive employees could also be a good thing. Spending these one points on movement speed and stuff like that could be good. So I think employee buffs might be more important than get attracting more customers. But attracting more customers could lead to more sales. So don't want to say what is better, right? I can't really judge. It depends on how much it is. If it's only like 5 to 10%, it, we, we still might be okay. But you can see already it's pretty compact. And if that's the case, people are going to start stealing. Because the rack is full. Oh, sorry, the, the tiller is full. Yeah, dude. This is just w way too full. Well, there you have it, right? I mean, we do need another, another cashier. Where's my item? So this is a big problem for us, dude. Bro, it's so big. That's what she said. I don't know, dude. We're not going to fit one here. So, buy shop space. Really? Back there. Okay. It's like the worst possible spot, dude, uh, for where we are right now. Hey. Dude, you get a self-checkout on this game.
Okay, but we get more money from... I can't read it now. But you, I think you get more money from employees doing the cashier stuff. Petting the, the cat. So I think we want another, another cashier here. But South Counter though. But it's such a waste, dude. Right? We might also need to help and I don't know. It's two and a half thousand dollars for it. Nah. Uh, let's do this. get piled up over here but it's fine and then whenever we need another cashier I could just uh, change you know one of the stock takers to do that I dude if I knew that there are self checkouts I would have saved until I got my first one um, but now it's too late we already got a skill point to get like 10% more money from customers from employees doing checkouts so it's just better that way. Much better. Because now we get paid more per product, if that makes sense. But maybe... Uh, I assume this is the case, but I think... Um, the self-checkout will also not be as productive. But there's no way of telling right now. Dum 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 dum. We have great twerking music right here. that cat food though it's raining boxers everywhere let's try and get the stuff in the storage Hey, it's zero. Free money. So yeah, once we get those also, where our restockers will actually recycle it, and it's four times more worth. Bro, it's almost, it's almost $10 per box then. But that is like really deep into the game. Like, like really deep. So that to happen, we need to go 
all the way down this path and get that one. And then all the way down this path and get this one. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 levels away. And that means also I'm not going to have anything else, right? No employees extra, so... It's easily about 14, maybe even more levels away. Which is quite a lot, actually. Are you winning, son? We have two skill points again. Yeah, this time I think we're ready to, to handle more customers. I think. I hope. Aircon. Attract more customers. And we do actually have one. How useful that is. Don't ask me. It might be the most useless thing, I don't know. But guys, we're going to actually end this video over here. Let's end our day first. Day 18 done. We're getting 2,000 experience. 5,500 income. And uh, robbery is zero because I took care of them. And our balance is minus $3,000. <laughs> products bought. In total, $7,000 worth of products was bought. That's insane. Absolutely ridiculous. But I actually do enjoy this game. Like I said before, I just wish the collusion was a, a little bit better. Uh, we also have a lot of room now, even in the middle, uh, to potentially get quite a bit of licenses still. We need to put a shelf here, maybe on each side. But yeah. Hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video. Thank you so much for taking time today supporting the channel. If you did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe if you are new, and I'll catch you in the very next video. Remember, the more you guys support the series, the more we're going to play. Take care. Bye-bye.